Hey guys, this is a therapist task guide for pursuit of power. For this task, you have to locate Santer's letter on shoreline and then survive an extract in order to hand the letter over to therapist. So here's a map of shoreline and I do have marked the three different locations where the letter can potentially spawn with them being at the pier, the power station, and also at Santer's cottage. And now I will bring you guys onto shoreline and show you each location in game with a picture of what it looks like when the task is active. Starting with the pier location, I am here beside the two-story main building and the letter is located inside this little store that is behind the two-story building. Now, if it did spawn inside of this little store, then it will be just next to the cash register leaning up against the desk and it will look just like in this photo. And just be aware that if you are going to go down to the pier to check this spawn location, that you should approach this area with a little bit of caution initially because it could potentially be a spawn for Sanitar. Or when you do end up leaving, then there is always the chance that a PMC will try and hold you from being able to leave this pier location. So just be aware of that before heading down here. So the next area is going to be at the center of the map at the power station. So I am just outside of the power station area right now. But if we do go inside of this front door, then we can take a left and then go into the back room on the first floor of the power station. Once you go in through this door, then you will notice a table with some papers on it. And then on the top of this table, the letter can be in the upper right hand corner of the table. And then this is where it did end up spawning for me in this raid. So this is where it is located for you if it did spawn here. Just be aware when you are approaching or leaving this area of the two sniper scavs that can potentially spawn up on top of the roof. Now you will also have to survive an extract with a note to be able to hand it over to therapist. So just remember if you do happen to die in between obtaining the letter and then extracting that you will have to come back to shoreline and then try and locate the letter again. And then the last potential spawn is going to be over at Santar's Cottage. So I have moved us over here on the road in between the blue fence of construction and Santar's Cottage. But if we do head into the cottage area and then go over to the trading post table, then the note will be located on top of the medical boxes to the left of this table. And then it will look something like this if it did end up spawning here. And then you can just pick up the note and then head towards the extract. Just be aware that this area is also one of Sanitar's possible locations to spawn at, so just be cautious as you are approaching here just in case him or his guards didn't end up spawning here. And also be aware that PMCs can be lurking up in the hills looking down into this area, or also can be inside of this compound as well who are also trying to do this task, or even just to look for Sani in order to hunt him. And also just remember that you will have to survive an extract with this note to be able to hand it over to Therapist, and if you do happen to die in between obtaining the letter and then extracting, then you will have to come back to shoreline and then try and locate the letter all over again. So hopefully you guys found this task guide useful and it does help you complete this task. Thank you guys so much for watching all of my task guides on this event. I greatly appreciate you and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day and I'll see you in the next one. So what you're seeing on the screen right now is just a couple of my different social links in case you guys wanted to connect more easily. I am primarily streaming on Twitch now multiple nights a week. So if you do want to connect with me or my community, that would probably be the easiest way to do so. And if you do come over to the Twitch and you want to join the Discord community, then just type exclamation point Discord or cord in the chat in order to get an invite link. And if you don't use Twitch, then I do have a link in the picture as well as a link below in the description. And we are growing and currently have an active and welcoming community with people of all experience and skill levels. So there will always be someone who could help to answer any questions that you may have. As always, thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching the video, and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day.